Hello and welcome to Star Citizen. Today we're talking about fixing the crashes. There have been a load of issues with the last couple of patches for Star Citizen Alpha, and we're going to talk about some of the common fixes to those problems. Install the latest drivers for everything. I know that's an obvious one, but it's worth checking. I use a program called Driver Booster 2 that I find really useful. I'll link it in the description. It's totally free, although you can pay for a license if you want or if you want to support the product. But that being said, there are some other likely culprits for Star Citizen crashing. Many players were reporting issues with these C++ redistributables. For some reason I found that quite hard to say. Uh, uninstall them and reinstall them and then make sure you've got the latest versions of them. Many people have reported this has fixed their crashes. I'll put links to all of this in the description by the way so you don't have to go trawling the internet yourselves. NVIDIA driver crashes. Disabling G-Sync in the NVIDIA control panel apparently works for some people, but that will only be applicable to some users. Also, the NVIDIA driver version 3.0 3.06. This driver and its predecessor hate Star Citizen for some reason. There's a hotfix driver available that fixes some of the G-Sync issues, but also has a good success rate on Star Citizen. I think it's driver 353.12. I'll put a link again in the description. Other than that, you can try an older driver which has quite a lot of success with Star Citizen and actually gives me a little bit of a frame boost, uh, like driver 350.05. Again, linked in the description. Setting up a user.cfg and messing around with the settings for it can actually fix a world of issues, increase your frame rates and stability. The latest user.cfg video we have made is linked in the description again. That will tell you everything you need to know about how to make a user.cfg and probably what settings are right for you. Running low or running out of RAM seems to be a common issue. There are memory leaks and RAM issues all over the place with this alpha, but I only seem to crash personally when my RAM was maxed out. I've used a program now called uh, Game Booster to reduce RAM usage and clear unnecessary processes. Again, that program's free. I'll link it in the description. But also, setting up your page file size uh, can help in a lot of cases as well. I would recommend setting a page file on one of your hard drives to 1.5 times your RAM. Lots of people are going to have issues with that. Lots of people are going to say that you don't need to do that or you should set it a different size. But this works for me uh, and lots of people are reporting uh, it working for them. So if you've got 8 gigs of RAM, for example, you should set your page file to 12 gigabytes. There will be a link in the description again about setting up page files uh, and more Star Citizen tweaks. I did some videos on that a while ago. LAN and Ethernet drivers. Lots of people seem to be having issues stemming from their Ethernet drivers. Just make sure you've got the latest version from your manufacturer's site. That's the selection of the most common solutions to Star Citizen 1.1.3 crash issues. I'm assuming though that that will probably fix them in the future as well. These are some of the problems that may be persistent for quite a while in the alpha, unfortunately. But if you still have any other problems or a different issue, please post in the comments below. I do try and read them all and lots of smarter peoples than myself frequent my channel uh, and regularly help too. Hopefully that's helped at least some of you. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. It really does help me and I will see you in the verse.